Hi, this is Elena with Liberty Oxygen and Medical Equipment. I'm actually here today to show you how to set up your CPAP machine when you're doing a curbside pickup. So when you get home, you're gonna go ahead and open up your bag here. You can see everything's got a compartment for everything. We're gonna first start off with taking the machine out. Then we're gonna go ahead and get the tubing out. Take Some literature, there is a spot for everything. Go ahead and put that literature in here for safekeeping. Now your tubing is gonna connect onto the back of your machine. There is a computer plug and a computer port for this tubing. Right there. You click that in. This does have a swivel and it will not come out unless you push on these two little buttons here. Once you pinch that, it will come out very easily. Not in, in. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take out the water chamber. And that is gonna go right into the side here. You can see here on it, that's your warming plate. Warming plate. Not in, in. It's gonna have a spot for your fingers here and your thumb here, kind of a grippy. Give it a squeeze to pull that out. This does have a little bit of a squeeze here so you can kind of see how that moves. This is how you're gonna get your water chamber in and out. There's a latch here to be able to open and fill. So put that in, fill it with your distilled water up to this water line right here. Go ahead and put that in. Okay, now the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna pull out your power cord. Now your power cord comes in two pieces and you wanna remember that so that when you are, maybe in the future if the power is not working on your machine, that is one place to look. It connects here in the center and then it connects to your machine. You will see right here, yellow, yellow. Only use this power cord for this machine. We will have your machine set to your pressures based on your prescription. So then you would just go ahead and give it, plug it on in and it will turn on for you. There is some settings in here that you can do to be able to look and see what you need but basically connect your tube your mask to this tubing and turn it on and then it will run according to your prescription so everything is set up here you can see the light going on You can hear that that air is on. So it is a very quiet machine. And shut that off if you don't need that on. There are some settings here that if you wanted to, um, you can look at your sleep report to see how well the mask is fitting. And you can also, uh, if you like change your mask in the middle of having your machine a few months later, you can change it from pillows to full face or nasal. Um, but basically, you plug this all in, go to bed, put on your mask and hit your power button. And then you're set to go. Mm -hmm. Now, every CPAP machine, when you come get our stuff for curbside, we will send you home with a bunch of papers and in there will be one very important one, and that is how to keep your uh, CPAP machine clean. You are going to want to, every morning, unhook your tubing from the back and hang it up to dry. So you're gonna take that all out. You do not have to unhook your mask, but you do need to wipe it off every morning. Hang that to dry. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to take out your water chamber, open that up, dump out all the water and leave that to dry. Now, once a week, 
you're going to need to do your cleaning of soaking all your supplies. And then once a month or every other week, you're going to want to change your filter. On the side here is your filter compartment. Doesn't really matter which way this goes. You just set it on in, shut the compartment. I hope that helps. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to give us a call here at Liberty. Have a great day.